Hi everyone, it's Angel from avpan.com and I thought I'd continue my tripod review by talking about my tripod head. It is the uh, Really Right Stuff BH55 and I really like it. I got it at the beginning of 2013 so I've had this for over a year now and I really really like it. It's really sturdy, it's really durable, I've taken it through uh, snow, rain, heat, cold, and it just holds up so well. But when I got it, I had my Gitzo tripod legs and I had the Gitzo head that came with it. So when I first got it and I tried to attach it to my legs, there was a little bit of a problem, like it wouldn't attach. And so I uh, contacted Really Right Stuff and asked them what the problem was. I think it was like a screw that was in the Gitzo legs that was worn out or something like that. And I had to get a replacement Gitzo screw which really right stuff had and it was so easy to get it was really simple i think it was like five or ten dollars there wasn't much at all just to get that screw in and then um once that happened it was really easy to put on and to use right away so my first impression of this was that it was really big and it's really um really it's really big and it's a little bit overbearing um, the reason why I got the BH55 is because I read so many great reviews about different photographers getting it, all kinds of photographers. Um, but I think if I had to do it again, I would get a slightly smaller one. It's just a little bit heavy for me. And even though this is big and really reliable, I feel like all of their ball heads would be very durable and very reliable. So I would personally would go with a smaller one but because this is just makes the tripod really big and really heavy. But other than that, I love this tripod head, this uh, ball head, and it makes taking pictures so much easier. So much easier than when I had just the regular uh, tripod head. So uh, what you do is you would just like loosen this up and then you can take pictures, move this head 360, and it's so easy to take pictures with that. And if you do decide to invest in this tripod head, I would definitely recommend getting the L bracket for your camera. It's just um, a bracket that you screw in onto your camera. And what it does is that it makes it so easy for you to go from horizontal to vertical. It's so easy. And it's really nice because it leaves your camera basically in the same place so you don't really have to move it around so much. And also you won't have your camera all dangling off to the side like, and it's really, it can be unsturdy that way. So overall I really like this, it's really durable, it's really nice, it's, you know, you can really trust this ball head to not drop your camera at all. I completely trust this ball head, but the only thing is it's a little big, a little bit bulky, but if you're ready to upgrade your ball head, I would definitely recommend checking out Really Right Stuff because they have really good stuff. So if you have this ball head, let me know what you think of it. And if you have a different kind that you really like, just let me know what it is. Because I've seen on Really Right Stuff, they have several kinds of ball heads. And I know on different manufacturers, they have ball heads. I think the next one that I would be looking into would be a panoramic one. Just to make my panoramics a little bit easier to line up. So if you have one of those, let me know, and I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you later. Bye. And then same thing with bringing them up, you just lock them up. And I really like how when you fold it up, all these knobs um, come close to